<laughs> Hello. It's the one and only Cassie. All right, so I'm heading out and I am going to an event and be wearing a gown. I can't believe it. They gave, they loaned me a dress that I'm going to be wearing. I'm just feeling really flattered to be able to, to do this, but I don't have any shoes. I just wear flats, sneakers, flat sandals, you know me. So I need to find something that's not Doc Martini, <laughs> but it's the exact opposite. So I'll take you with me. Men's vintage blazer. I actually want to look for something that's cropped because this is so long and I feel like in the summer I need something lighter. I'm wearing a Zara halter neck top. Wearing my collection for Amazon, the drop. So I'm wearing shoe wise, I'm wearing the Chanel dad sandals. Lipstick is Fireball and I'm wearing the B25 that I got from Paris. That is it, I'm out. Oh, and glasses, I'm not sure. Probably the end of the stories, another you know, tortoise show ones, those. Okay, bye. So here we are, Fifth Avenue. Uh, the plaza is right there, and the Goodman is right in between those trees. By the way, can I say how nice it is today? Look at this, everyone's just like hanging out, chilling, relaxing. It's absolutely a beautiful day. I really like being in New York in the summer. It's just, it's just great. Look at this. Fantastic. Oh, and that's Apple right there. And of course you can hear the obligatory police sirens. People wouldn't be in New York without that sound, would it? We're going through the bag department in Bergdorf. This is Loe Bay over there, it's Chloe. Take us to the shoes. Will I find something? That is the question. Insert choir singing and the skies parting. This is so me. Gorgeous, right? Look at that. It's the same colour as the dress. But how versatile is that colour in general for me? The idea of a wedge. Maybe do a wedge instead. Oh, I love the point of these. completely random Hello. meeting. Can you believe it? Hello. Yeah. Every video you're saying that. I know. <laughs> I like them. Oh, I have those in my car. <laughs> oh, God, Janae. <laughs> are they comfortable? Yeah, they're very comfortable. My toes need doing. <laughs> they look super cute. They I are. like them. I really like them. So different. And the good options of the day, I think. Since the last time Just a shame they're just too small. But no, seriously, I'm, I'm, these in black would be amazing. 
Do you all know that Kitten Hill is? And they're so cool. But even that's what I'm wearing. Right? And I've got a silver one, which is really cool. But the black is way more um, useful. Or even the nude. But I really like the black. I'm pretty sure they won't have my size. This is not for the event, by the way. This is just for dinners and stuff. Underneath your clothes. the modern Cinderella shoe. <gasps> oh, do you know I actually want these in black? You know how I feel about a good 70s kick-ass platform boot rather. And this is fulfilling. At least I know I've got my stuff in the car these. But a black, a black. Through a star I follow look good like just if, like ripped up denim jeans like baggy jeans or if I'm going to um, just events in general I've got these to wear with like with my men's suits right can you imagine it my men's suits I'm breaking all my promises now We'll see if we get any luck in there. I see shoes I like, but it's about my size. Right, I'm at Giovanni Rossi. These are stunning. I think these are so good. I really love these. Oh, this essay won't leave me alone. You got it? Yeah. Okay, let's see. Same issue, love. I actually really like these. But they're too flipping small. Oh, I should just cut my toes off. Big. It's so hard to find a shoe that fits you right. Oh, it's just so difficult. But I know I'm looking for a platform, so we'll see. I'm trying on a pair of cock guys next. I don't want to wear a pair of like skinny, spiky type of shoe here. Anyone else have these problems, like with heels, like if you have big feet? Oh my god, this is so comfortable. Well, I can't believe how comfortable they are and they don't fit. I know, stripper shoes, right? I love them. Anything 70s looking. Look at these, look at these. Too small, but they're so good. It feels like Is Cinderella gonna find some freaking shoes for this um, event? Um, no, I was selling them online for a little while. I was selling them on Amazon. Um, what is the name? Um, they, they're actually my my own line, like uh, Karen Bridchick is the name of the line. Okay, but it was yeah, but they're sold out. But I'm. Um, you should make them more. I should make yeah. I may have to make more they're of them because really really I really pretty. thank you. I love I love them so much. Yeah, and they're really nice. They're so they're so cool and they're so comfortable. They're really cool. Yeah, with the thing on them. Yeah. So you see something that it does fit you and it's really not just fitting you physically, but it's fitting you style wise as well. These products are super comfortable. And look at that brown. They're like a kind of a toffee brown patina. Can you see that? They're absolutely gorgeous. You can wear these for the dress.
to an event with mulberry still haven't found the shoes that i want uh, i'm wearing a mulberry alexa bag i'm wearing it with a cult gaia top and white linen pants and that's kind of it and the red lipstick by mac all right i'm gone happening I'm getting ready to leave oh, the stress is absolutely jaw-dropping carrying the Herrera stunning Wow well, I am ready I'm ready carrying the Herrera as is the dress. This is all on loan. I did my makeup myself. I want to do like a, a tutorial on it on my Instagram and TikTok. If you want to see how I did this, stunning dress. I'm ready. <laughs> So the um, award ceremony happened and it was amazing. I sent you, well, I showed you some footage just now. That was such a moment wearing that dress. The shoes I went with, because remember I was looking for a pair of like heels to wear with that dress because the dress is super long um, and it was just pulling and dragging on the floor and I didn't want it to do that. So I was looking for like platform sandals or platform shoes heels really high skyscrapers couldn't find anything ended up um just emergency buying a pair of like steve madden shoes just just to get something and i actually love those shoes now um and when i was wearing them at the event someone was giving me a compliment on them which is really nice oh my gosh my makeup looks a bit strong doesn't it huh? let's go downstairs yeah like i was saying i was so um i ended up just getting those steve maddens and i actually really like them i think they're gorgeous and i'm really glad i I got them. They're super high, super, super high. Uh, but that's exactly what I wanted. And I just love that silhouette of them. It was great to go. I didn't know anyone at the event. Absolutely no one I knew there. And it can feel weird. Like you're all dressed up, you walk into a room, there's a sea of people and you don't know anyone and you're by yourself and they're all talking amongst each other. So it's, it can feel a bit intimidating because you're basically alone. Um, even at the dinner, everyone was, had assigned seating and it was a round table setting. Like there was about, I don't know, 30 tables or more in the floor, beautiful. And um, I didn't know anyone at the table either. So you're making conversations with, uh, sorry, you're making conversation with complete strangers. 
which can feel a bit weird because everyone at the table seemed to all know each other and I was the only one I felt who didn't know anyone so it's, it's a very strange feeling you know you just gotta put your put your big girl pants on and then just start making conversation which is exactly what I did and I'm glad I did because um, I got to introduce to people from the perfume and the beauty industry so that is it today uh, a couple of days have passed by the way but um, I have to run out I've got to do a few things today and then I'm going to um, I don't know I might, I might shoot street style today I'll either shoot it today or I'll shoot it tomorrow or actually maybe I'll shoot it both days um, but yeah I'm gonna go now, but I'll see you in a bit. My hair is still back. I need to actually undo it. Look at my forehead. I have pure Sade forehead. <laughs> Welcome to Americana. Look what at this breakfast. Have? I know, look at this breakfast diner menu. What would you, what would you get? How the heck I'm gonna eat this because this is the strangest eggs Benedict I've ever seen. I Let's go in here and see. I haven't been in this location before. Oh, look at this one. Why am I whispering? Oh, look at this one. Michael, look at this one. This one right here on the side. That's stunning. How much is this one? Oh, guess how much it is. Don't look at the price. What is this made of? Wood? Is it wood? Yeah. Um, I want to figure See out where to put flat it. On the bottom? No, but I love it. shoot street star um episode 27 i think of what everyone is wearing in new york dressed very comfortably i'm in an oversized um, men's shirt and i'm wearing my just a pair of like loose linen-y kind of uh, I'm let this down a bit loose linen um shorts i showed these before in my summer haul video i'll link that if you haven't seen it of some new things that I got in, but I love these shorts. I have been, honestly guys, I have been living in these shorts. So you know this already, I'm wearing my Fendi uh, baguette. This is actually the color of it. It's kind of darkness like that. It's, this is how it looks. So I just want you to see, it's stunning, it's so good. Wearing these like sort of dark bluey kind of glasses. Anyway, that's the whole look. <laughs> I'll see you later. I changed my jacket and I am I kept the rest the same actually I changed the shoes as well no, everything black shoes really and bag um, I'm now going to the public hotel I'm meeting my management my manager she's here she's not normally based in New York but she's going to be here uh, for a couple of days so we're gonna meet up Yes, I am. I am meeting Cassie. Cassie.
Cassie Thorpe. I'm sure a lot of you already know who that is. She is now in New York and I feel like I swear it's like a British invasion. Like we're taking over America one, one blogger at a time. So she's here now and we're gonna have um, lunch together and I can't wait. I've never met her in person but we, we know each other with you know online online friends. But anyway, so so excited. I'll take you with me, obviously. Oh by the way I am by the way I'm wearing um top shop Marjala baggy jeans and the Balenciaga. Bloody hell it's really windy I should have bought my jacket signs have finally come true. Oh my god, yeah, that's so true! <laughs> you manifested oh, it. I know, I know, without even thinking. Without even oh my god. Oh, look at that, two Brits in one video. There you go. <laughs> so glad you're here. I know, me too, me yeah. too. I can't um, wait to show her around as well. Exactly, and in a fabulous setting to kick it off with, and it will be the first of many. There you go. Yeah. Well, boom. <laughs> Cassie's doing up her place um, in New York and we just uh, we came in from just lunch and we, this is just good to come in just to get some inspiration. Oh god. Actually where are we doing our upstairs? This is good for inspo. <laughs> 